everybody we are going to talk about the movie rabid now this is not the old krungen krungen oh my god i probably shouldn't try to say names right now the old movie from the 70s what was it 77 this is the new one that the soska sisters and i am so sorry if i did not say their name right just bear with me head concussion 2019 IMDb gives it a 5.1 out of 10 it is a reimagining of David Cronenberg's classic after a young woman suffers a disfiguring accident she un undergoes an experimental stem cell treatment that leads to consequences I am having trouble with it <laughs> um this one is done by the brilliant Soska Twins. They're also known for American Mary, which is amazing. I absolutely love that movie. And um, I tried to find it on Tubi, because or not Tubi, Voodoo, because I was like, oh, I think I'm excited to have a movie sale. And this one was five bucks at the time. I was like, oh, maybe American Mary's on sale. You can't buy it on Tubi. Or not Tubi. Voodoo, for some reason. But it is on Tubi for free to watch, so I will eventually. It's just after my fall, just everything went downhill. <clears throat> they also are known for See No Evil 2. Yes, I did enjoy that one. And they have so they have a huge line by and I just heard my phone vibrate. I don't know if that got picked up on there or not. At least I turned it off this time. Uh, the twins do make a cameo in this movie. Uh, the lead woman, she already had one accident and people, she worked at like a modeling fashion industry type thing, so looks at pretty much everything. Uh, she already had one accident where she had some minor scars, almost kind of like my, not that, but my like chicken pox scars. Uh, one's a chicken pox and one's a mole being removed scar, almost like that. It was just like a few minor scratches and stuff. You couldn't really see that bad. But they berated her for those scars. And I kind of understand. I've dealt with it myself. But it was more for the mole than I had before I had it removed than anything. <clears throat> but I am just completely off topic right now. Uh... Oh, the scrubs, when she goes to get, she has another accident that completely disfigures her, takes off like part of her jaw, and it's just, it's a horrible accident. And she goes to this place that's going to do the experimental surgery, and the doctors, they have interesting scrubs. It's almost cult-like. That's what I took it as. Now, I don't remember if this is from the first movie or not. Um, I don't really remember a whole lot. The first time I ever watched the first movie is during the Joe Bob's first marathon. And I don't really... I only remember kind of bits and pieces of it. So I don't remember if the surgical team had the same scrubs as the ones in this movie. But this one, they were bright red and cult-like and very interesting um looks like she completely de deforms during her cravings unlike just the armpit there was one scene that um it didn't really sh have the camera on her it had it like behind her and you like see stuff so i couldn't tell at that time if she just like completely disformed because or if it was just the armpit tentacle we'll call it um the Gunter guy, that was his name, and I probably said it wrong, has the same mind, mindset as a scary large amount of the population. Now, uh, when you watch, if you watch the movie, you'll know what I'm talking about. Because um, there was a rabies, uh, ep I think it was epidemic. I think that was what it was called, epidemic, not pandemic. I think it was epidemic. <clears throat> and then I put on here, oh, it's arms, Armpit Supreme. I like it. And then there it says, oh, nice creature. Um, oh, I'm. there was one scene that they did experiments on another person. So instead of having just the armpit tentacle, she was a little bit more elaborate. 
The original was in 1977 and had Marilyn Chambers in it. Um, I do know who remembers what. Uh, I'm probably just because I'm having trouble reading it. My notes is probably why it doesn't make sense to me. Um, oh, I don't know. If, uh, I was trying to talk about the Twitter of suspending the Soska sisters for trying to promote this movie. It was a whole big thing, but they got their account back. Um, that's about all the details I really remember of that right now. I'm a little bit foggy. Um, I know people hate on remakes, but I highly suggest this one. It has its own differences, but still in the long line of the original. Definitely check this one out. And I am also sad that I couldn't buy American Mary on Voodoo. Talking, what? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm having issues, but the show must go on. Uh, but I did find, like I said, did find it on Tubi, so maybe eventually I'll be trying to watch American Mary. I already had this uh, review typed out, and you see how much trouble I had with it trying to remember and uh, read my notes. Oh, by the way, I gave this movie a 7 out of 10. I really did enjoy it. Um, I bought it. It was on sale on Vudu. I do not know if it is still on sale on Vudu, but it was at the time I bought it, which I couldn't tell you the date at the time. So my head is just the. Um, I know it was both versions were on sale for 5 bucks on Vudu. Because I remember I retweeted it, and then the Soska sisters uh, retweeted me and thanked me for uh, the mention. So hopefully, maybe they'll like me. No, I did. I know I did a horrible job on this interview. I did try. I'm just with my head concussion. It's just it's really hard to read my notes and trying to remember stuff. So so hopefully, well, like I said I already had the notes wrote out for this one and hopefully when I do my next review which I have not done I do not have anything else lined up right now I won't have issues with my notes or being able to talk about the movie because if you notice we're in a different setting because I also hurt my knee which is on the same leg as my uh foot this messed up so I can't get upstairs to where my normal filming area is so I don't know we'll just have to see what goes from here <laughs> wait till I start getting better maybe but I am doing my best to get videos out there but yeah forget all that nonsense um uh, rabid definitely go check it out the Soska sis sisters did an amazing job and I highly recommend it. So definitely go check it out. And like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you next time.